Hey peeps, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a goodies haul from the Festival of Quilts, uh, which was at the Birmingham NEC last weekend. My mum very kindly treated uh, myself, my sister-in-law, and her mum to VIP tickets for the weekend, so we were thoroughly spoiled and it was amazing. And I may have bought all the fabric. Um, before I start showing you the goodies that I got, I did want to just share this one quilt, which was my favourite from the show by far. I'll insert a picture of it here. And I just think this is absolutely stunning. I couldn't believe that it was a quilt and I want it. So yes, if I ever get a spare couple of thousand pounds, I shall make this lady an offer because it's gorgeous. Um, anyway, you've come here to see all, all the new goodies that I picked up, so without further ado, um, so before I get to the fabric, I'm going to show you the few little bits and pieces that I picked up, and we, uh, as we were VIPs, we got given um, free gifts when we arrived, which was wonderful, and also, festival of quilt tote bags. Very handy for lugging around all the things that I bought. So the first up was this um, set of Metla embroidery threads and they had three sets so we picked up one of each. And then also it was this bag of uh, fabric co covered buttons, a couple of, oh yeah that's open, a couple of um, grab bags of different size buttons and some lace tape which is going to be awesome for hems and stuff like that. So that was really nice. Um, then I also managed to find some refills for my friction pens which is awesome because I'm going through these at a rate of knots and that's because I use them to write in my diary and to also uh, write on fabric because if you don't know friction pens um, come away with heat um, so you can rub them off off paper and you can iron them off fabric do double check um, that they come off your fabric before you start drawing all over it because I'd hate to be responsible for some, something not coming off but Love this stuff, so I've got the refills for them. I also picked up this amazing um, metallic thread. I'll insert a clip here, um, close up of it, and it's a, a metallic embroidery thread. And I love using variegated threads for um, different embroidery designs, but the ones that have like a, just no no colour changes in them. So I'm really excited to get playing around with that. I also picked up some wool. This is Sublime Lustrous Extra Fine Mer Merino Double Knit and it is stunning. I loved this stuff. It's kind of got like uh, the tealy colour with uh, silver woven over it. Um, I bought five balls of that and there are hang on, 25 grams or 95 metres approximately in each. So I've got five, five balls of this and I'm going to do a trade with my mum. Uh, she bought fabric and I bought wool so sh I'll make her a dress and she'll knit me a cardigan. Well in fact she's going to have to knit me more than one because I've also picked up this Debbie Bliss Luxury Silk Double Knit and there is 100 metres of this and it's variegated again and it is just absolutely stunning. It's 100% silk, it's so so soft and it was I think £7 uh, ball and I picked up 10 because mum and I are going to share that she's going to have half I'm going to have half so yeah very very happy with that love this stuff it's so beautiful um, so next up my inner magpie was incredibly happy because I stumbled across RTJ trims and I will put all the d uh, links in the description bar down below and as I say my inner magpie just was very very happy as this is the sort of thing they sell um, I'll insert a clip close up for you and this is just beautiful and it happens to be just the right shape of the grey stress neckline that I make so I'm planning on making myself a rather fancy one of those. They also had, which is the first thing that I saw, this um, pansy trim which again I'll insert a link, a close up for you. Um, this is stunning and they had it in I think six or seven different colourways, they have got it on their website. They were selling it for £7.50 per metre and you got, if you bought two, you got the third half price. And I wanted to use this with a silk dupioni that I have and make an evening gown. 
and I wanted it to trim the hem so I and I wanted a circle skirt so I knew I needed a lot and I think I've got six meters in the end and they gave me a really good deal for the that and the, the neck trim so yeah really really happy with that love this stuff now we have fabric and um, this first one that I'm going to show you I got from fabrics galore which you probably have all heard of it is um the michael miller no it's not it's alexander henry i told you a lie it's alexander henry uh it's a 2008 um print and it's called midnight snack and and i've been eyeing up on modes for you for ages and they sold out of it so when i saw this i was like mm, must have must have now so i've got three meters of this so this next doll I didn't get the name of and they didn't give me a card with their details on so I'm really sorry I won't be able to link to their shop. Um, they had loads and loads of bolts of fabric and it was everything from uh, quilters cotton to linen to canvas to uh, all sorts of different dressmaking fabrics as well. Um, this one has just got little darling across the selvage and it is blue flamingos. How awesome are they? So um, I bought, it's really wide, it's 16 inches wide, so I bought two meters of this and I'm gonna make myself a really full gathered skirt out of it. And if I've got enough left, I will make a, um, like a crop top to go with it because I really like um, wearing dresses because you only have to think about one thing. So coordinates really appeal to me, but um, yeah, blue flamingos. I then bought, because my mum pointed them out, pink flamingos and it's on kind of like a canvas and I only bought um, half a meter of that again it's really wide six inches wide and I'm hoping I'm going to be able to make some bags with that and um, so I also bought a half a meter of this canvas with this kind of sewing different sewing related items print on it because I just thought it was awesome and again I'm planning on making bags with that um, right next up again I don't have um, the details for this fabric from the shop that I bought it from but it is a beautiful um, fabric from Moda and it's called Autumn Elegance um, and it's by Sentimental Studios under the Moda um, brand and it is stunning okay I'm gonna insert a close-up for you it's this um, really beautiful sort of burnt orange color with um, like uh, red and blue berries all over it and then it's loads and loads of um, gold detailing in it so I thought I would make myself um, a Vogue V8947 I think I've got that right dress uh, with sleeves um, for the autumn um, because I do wear cotton dresses in autumn and winter I just layer them up an awful lot so um, the thing that really changes the print and the colours and I saw this and I absolutely loved it so the next fabric I got is from fabrictime.co.uk and again I will put their link in the description bar down the bottom. Um, it's another really wide one, it's 60 inches and they were selling this for £6 a metre and it is stunning, let me show you. There you go. I uh, saw this on the on the bolt and was just like, oh yeah, I need to have that, that's rather pretty. And took it home, this was on day one and my niece was at home, she surprised us for the weekend and she loved it too and so her grandmother very kindly bought her some as well so she's got uh, a whole length i think i bought myself five meters and she's got three meters and we are going to have nearly matching dresses so this is the last length of fabric i got and it is by timeless treasures and it's uh, called c c as in see the word and see the letter and it is done here Um, my friend, my best friend and I have a ongoing joke uh, that she is not an octopus, that octopi learn faster than she does. And so anything octopus related, I tend to snap up and this just is so beautiful. So like I said, I've got just over three meters as that was all that was left. And I think I paid 12 pounds a meter for that. So the other thing that I got from um, the, uh, this shop, which is called fabrics at Fleetwood is this fabric called gold standard or simply sterling and it's the new world map and it is like gold print on black 
and this is for my sister-in-law's mum and it's going to be an evening bag for her for when she goes on her cruises which she does quite frequently so i just wanted to say thank you so much to all my new subscribers and to all my old subscribers as well i can't quite believe how much this channel has grown over the last couple of months i'm absolutely loving doing these videos and i'm loving the sewing community that's growing on youtube um it seems that there's a new sewing vlogger popping up every day and it's wonderful to see if one's different takes on fabrics and patterns and things like that so i'm i'm loving it thank you for so much for all the comments as well it's been really interesting getting to know some of you and the um different things that you take away from the videos so yeah it's i read every single one and it's been it's been lovely to uh, become a part of this growing community on YouTube. Uh, and so with that, if you have enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't yet, please subscribe and I shall see you again very soon. Bye! Blue flamingos! So, um, keep saying, um, B footage! Look at me getting all technical. Hey peeps, welcome to and my uh, my fabric fluffer. So uh, Chiana uh, lives with me up here and I've got fabric out so she's very excited about the fact that there is new fabric for her to sit on. Are you going to come and say hello? This is my baby girl. Yes, you are stunning, I know. Yes, I am a crazy cat lady. But no, let me go, there is fabric to sit on. Yeah, right on it. <laughs> oh, look, and a tail. Get to the fabric, I'm gonna, yeah. No cheek, no lifting off the bag. Oh, baby, am I mean to you? And I was like, oh, I must take them home. I must adopt the blue flamingos. I am not even, it's like um, Benedict Cumberbatch saying penguins, fl flamingos, flamingo. <laughs> not all of it's for me. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Leafing over.